What impression has he made on you this season, the growth you've seen? Today? Who's that, sorry? Wall, yeah. Oh, he's uh, been great, obviously. He's been having a tremendous year. You know, came in and played some really good hockey for us last year. Got his feet wet and, you know, had a long uh, roll back and recovery-wise from an injury. And, you know, I think uh, just always has a big smile on his face. Just uh, really happy-go-lucky. And I really think that, uh, you know, helps his overall game. I think you see his skill set. Uh, you know, extremely talented, so uh, so much potential for him, and, and uh, goes to work extremely well every day. So, uh, probably a little bit more comfortable in his own skin around the group. Uh, um, you know, going through it a little bit more. So, but uh, yeah, he's uh, uh, been solid for us uh, uh, when called upon. Does it mean that you have him even when a guy like Matt Murray goes down? Yeah. And he's playing well. Like the comfort level with the goalie situation. Right? Yeah, I mean, our depth uh, uh, in goal throughout the organization is extremely strong. So. Um, you know him and Schaller, uh, you know, behind uh, Sammy and Murr, uh, obviously a, a, a great luxury to have. So, um, yeah, no doubt uh, uh, a real strength for us. How do you feel Michael Bunting is dealing with what has been a tough stretch with him? It feels like you know a couple of embellishment penalties and the squad of doing. What's your sense of how he's dealing with it? Because he has to play on the line to be effective. Yeah, I, th I think he's handled it well. Um, you know, I think as a group we've we've you know pushed him and challenged him to continue to to find that balance of. Uh, um, you know, playing his game, playing on the edge, but also understanding uh, the dynamic of uh, uh, of that, and and uh, you know, also uh, building uh, uh, building relationships with with the officials, and and uh, you know, the the respect goes both ways, and and all those sorts of things. And he's done a really good job with that, especially uh, over the last uh, few months here. I think he's really taken initiative of how he can how can improve on those things, understanding uh, that dynamic as, as a young player and plays with a lot of emotion, uh, plays hard and, and plays uh, plays on the edge. So uh, he's done a good job there. It's not always easy, so times can be uh, be frustrating, but uh, I think he's done a good job and, and uh, he'll only continue to learn, um, you know, through uh, um, you know through experience. Well, what would it mean to get O'Reilly back? I know obviously you guys are locked in, but just to get those, those reps. Yeah, no doubt. I think uh, obviously a massive part of our team and, and the role he's going to play. You know, saw the impact he's already made when he came in and played uh, um, here in the locker room, the presence he brings. So, uh, you know, he's right there. So um, we know it's going to be uh, any day now uh, in, the, in the near future. So excited about that. And obviously that'll go a long way in helping uh, uh, the chemistry build. John, it's a big game for you tonight, but also for a community you're looking to support. Do you feel like these Pride games have uh, renewed importance, especially with this year with the context around the NHL? Yeah, I mean, I, I think all all of our celebration games are extremely important. Uh, us as players in the organization and have always, uh, um, you know, tried to put a lot of importance on it. Obviously, on the night uh, that we're celebrating, but I think in, in how we conduct ourselves on a daily basis, um, in and around our locker room, in the community, with our fan base, um, you know, and, and in a year-round basis. So, um, yeah, definitely important. Have there been more conversations to make sure that everybody's sort of on the same page about what the message is? Uh, I, I think no doubt, uh, you know, there's been more conversation. I think understanding uh, the different dynamics, uh, different backgrounds people come from and all those sorts of things. But uh, uh, with that, I think, uh, uh, you know, reaffirms, I think, our importance in supporting, um, you know, all, all the different types of backgrounds and, and where people come from. And, um, you know, like one tonight with the, the LG uh, TBQ community and whatnot. So, um, you know, still really important for us. And, and we... Uh, um, you know, know uh, uh, how important inclusion is here uh, with the Maple Leafs, our team, and, and our organization.